Uh, okay. What can we equip to Liliana? Man, Liliana, she's a rogue. A bard. And a rogue. Ooh. That's good. It's an archer, basically. I don't know, man. Keep her with a bow. Healing. Uh, poison making. Shattering shroud. Right. Okay, we are good. We have a rogue. Improved feeling. I don't really. I will focus on survival with her. I think Hey Angie I made it What you made it bro? Your 
about food. Take it up with that bleeding runt by the chantry. I got other gear to sell. Oh, that's that's another vendor. Show me. Oh, let me see if have a backpack. Uh, shiny gold ring, a gift. Back in time, oh bro. I don't remember how to give gifts to companions. The combat is brutal. It's amazing, man. This is a true RPG game, honestly. He don't sell a backpack upgrade. He don't sell. At the camp, I think I remember, yeah. I don't spend my Fair money. About food. Take it up with that bleeding runt by the chantry. I got other gear to sell. Uh uh don't worry about him, I took care of it. You did? Well, I don't know what to say to that. Thanks. Give me the reward. Reward. Show me what you got. Maybe he have a... No. I expected after I'll do the quest for him, the... the items in the store will change and he sell the backpack upgrade i prefer to do the playthrough without buying items from the vendors gear like uh, gear i prefer to to manage as you say with what i get from loot for the RPG aspect. But what's the quest You're for this guy? Food. I got other gear to sell. Uh, no. Of any well paying work in uh, lottering? Check the chanter's board by the chantry. There's good jobs, huh? Uh, <clears throat> I don't suppose you know anything about uh, poison. What do you mean? I figured if I kept asking, I'd find someone. I'd pay good coin for some simple poison. Something to slow them beasties down or make them think twice. Okay. Any idea where I could get the ingredients? Well, there's herbs in the north wood. As for other stuff, look around town. Man, some I don't know about Some refugees just crafting. left things behind to travel faster. I don't really know what you need, though. I, I might have some in stock, too. Blackstone. As I guy? live and breathe, you're the Grey Warden everyone's been talking about. Yes, I am. Is there something I can, I can do for you? I represent the Blackstone Irregulars. We're a mercenary company that fell on hard times after the war with Orle. I'm sure you know that times are getting worse every day. With your help, the Irregulars could be of use to Ferelden once more. Okay. 
Uh, how can I be of service? Our leaders thought you might be willing to help. Each of our posts in Ferelden will contain letters addressed to you. Unlike most who work with us, you're getting letters straight from Railnor and Tauran, our leaders. I hope this tells you how highly the Irregulars regard the Grey Wardens. Man, I miss a time when uh, Bioware makes true RPG games. Like Dragon Age, like Mass Effect. You, you remember that time? Now they are making only shit. Thank you. When you've completed a mission, just return to me or any of our members stationed at an Irregulars post. We'll make sure your efforts are rewarded. Make us blessings light your path. Uh, Danal, who are you? You're gonna make more trouble? We Jade can, Empire, all yes. We can stand in Lothering now. Uh, sorry about the mess. They had it coming, and they were trouble enough themselves. So long as you don't start more, I won't get excited. Right then, name's Denial. Sorry I can't chat much. As you see, we have a full house. Uh... Have you heard any rumors? I hear that Tia Logain, the regent, is calling for new levies of troops. He wants to rebuild the army we lost at Astagar. Thing is... There's not a lot of spare men to be found. Out of Dragon's Peak, there's press gangs roaming around, grabbing any free man they can lay their hands on. Anything else I can get you? Uh, hear any other rumors? I hear tell they held a funeral in Denerim for King Caelan. The Grand Cleric called for a full day of mourning, and there was a procession a mile long passing by the Brasier. It's too bad they don't have a body to properly burn. What happened to him at the hands of those creatures, it's unthinkable. Anything else I can get you? I don't suppose you have any rooms. Look around. People are sleeping on the floors and in the attic. That's how many rooms I don't have. Okay. Who are these men I fought exactly? When Tian Logan marched by, he left those fellas behind to look for Grey Wardens. I suppose that's you. Yes, I am. Yes, it is. I have no qualm with you, whatever the turn says. My grandfather served. Your secret's safe with me. It's what can I get you then? Not a secret anymore. Luck speed your way. Already everyone in town know I'm a Grey Warden. Uh, quick save. Oh. Deserters, boom. Accept. A bard. Please, I must continue playing, else I earn no coin tonight. Uh, a door. Sixty one Coopers. It is begun. I could do that for you. Please, Liliana. Thank you very much. Man, I have a rogue now. Talk with the cook. I'll have no fighting in my kitchen. Out with you. Okay, okay, okay. I'm leaving. Now I can loot all the chests in town. I have a rogue. Did you speak to that knight yesterday? Said he was from Redcliffe. He talked to everyone in the tavern. 
How are we supposed to know where the urn of sacred ashes is? On Best be careful. Best be careful. Dark Greetings, my lord. A chest. Allow me. I could do that for you. Please. Yes, man, I have a lot of chests behind. How dare you accuse me of thievery? I saw you take the supplies from my car. Your grassland eyes are inept. A chastened would never stoop to petty theft. You marsh folk are all thieves and liars. Enough. People here are already desperate and frightened. They don't need you two coming to blows. But what about my food? I said enough. What's wrong with you guys? That Marshman stole from me, I know it! The carnage we left in the wilds was horrifying. Okay. You know this place will be overrun by the dark. Shokebasit Isra. Marad Starit. Marad Twasit. Who is this guy? Maras Shokra. Man, I don't remember. Who's this guy? You want one of my captors? Oh, he's a I companion. I have nothing to say that would amuse you, Elf. Leave me in peace. I remember him. He's even on Inquisition. I don't remember his name, but I'm 100% you can have him as a companion. Uh, you are a prisoner. Who put you here? I'm in a cage, am I not? I've been placed here by the Chantry. The revered mother said he slaughtered an entire family, even the children. It is as she says. I am Sten of the Beresad, the vanguard of the Kunari peoples. Uh, I'm Cristello. Pleased to meet you. You mock me. Or you show manners I have not come to expect in your lands. Though it matters little now, I will die soon enough. This is a proud and powerful creature, trapped as prey for the Darkspawn. If you cannot see a use for him, I suggest releasing him for mercy's sake alone. Mercy? I wouldn't have expected that from you. I would also suggest that Alistair take his place in the cage. <laughs> yes, that's what I would have expected. I suggest you leave me to my fate. Uh, what did you do to end up in here? I have been convicted of murder. Have the villagers not spoken of this? Are you guilty? Are you asking if I feel guilt or if I am responsible for the deed? However I feel, whatever I've done, my life is forfeit now. Who did you murder? The people of a farm hold. Eight humans, in addition to the children. Oh my god, that's horrible. I agree. Hmm. I am too interested in seeking atonement. Death will be my atonement. Oh my god, man. There are other ways to redeem yourself. Perhaps. What does your wisdom say is equal to my crime? I could help me defend the land against the Blight. The Blight? Are you a Grey Warden then? Yes, I am. Surprising. My people have heard legends of the Grey Warden's strength and skill. Though I suppose not every legend is true. Will the Reverend Mother let you free? Perhaps if you told her the Grey Wardens need my assistance. It seems as likely to bring my death as waiting here. Okay. 
I leave you for now. Farewell then. To be left here to starve? Or to be taken by the Darkspawn? No one deserves that. Not even a murderer. Okay. Man, by how to go to the camp? We don't know what was said. You're a warden. I don't know if you killed King Kalen, and make her forgive me, I don't care. But that bounty on your head could feed a lot of hungry bellies. Attack! That's a mistake, guys. That's a fucking mistake. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It's one more group behind. Send right. me. Oh. Ah. You will oh. learn to ah. fail me. Wait, there are a lot of them, man. a mistake guys what attack me do you want a bounty ha huh. uh, how dare you how dare you what is here hmm more enemies Ah! 
Little fucking dogs. There is no glo glory and bloodshed. More the oh. fools they. Hey, attack this guy, man. What you say? Reap Rest in peace Where's my loot? Where's my loot bro? There are more here Not exhaust our supplies. Oh. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. No quarter shall be given. Oh. Make a preserve. Oh. Right then. Best <laughs> be wary. Run while you can. Oh. 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 And this oh. oh, I'm stunned. I'm stunned. I'm stunned. Yeah, yeah, what did I tell you? Oh. It is begun. Fucking archers, man. The archers are really annoying. Really annoying. Ooh. Thank you. Liliana, take care of this. Lesser elixir of grounding. I don't know how many of these elixirs I will use. Honestly. My hound looks interested in this landmark. Hmm. Why? It shall be done. There are more here. I shall do it. It is begun. As you say. Back! <coughs> I never liked this <coughs>
part. Is that all my blood? What's wrong with the dog, man? Yeah. As you say. Nice. Oh, that was a bandit leader. Amazing. A chest. Hmm. Last one strength. Liliana, open this. Thank you. <laughs> I have a lot of loot. I shall do it. A blood mage. Let's do a hard save. What the heck is here? <laughs> Uh oh More of the fiends ahead! Very well. It is begun. Help. Timely arrival there, my friend. I'm much obliged. You're welcome. The name's Bodon Fedic, merchant and entrepreneur. This here is my son, Sandal. Say hello, my boy. Hello. <laughs> Roads be mighty dangerous these days. Mind if I ask what brings you out here? Perhaps we're going the same way. Sorry to say, bro, but your son looks very stupid. It's a bit complicated, but you're welcome to come along. Complicated? <laughs> Somehow I imagine that only says half of it. Thank mm. you for the offer, but there may be more excitement on your path than is good for my boy and me. Allow me Man. to bid you farewell and good fortune. Goodbye. Now then, let's get this mess cleaned up, shall we? This will be my vendor in, in the camp. 
This will be my vendor in a camp. I, I if I remember correctly. A gift. Oh, and the person with the runes. Okay. I will check that. It shall be done. I need to go in the camp. <laughs> oh, the alpha one. Both silver. Hey, Sandal. Hello. Hello. <laughs> oh, man. Like you see, that dude's. We'll be off as soon as this mess is cleaned up. Thank you, Carney, for all your assistance. Uh, I want to go in the camp. Hey! Oh. Oh. Wow. Hmm. <laughs> Bad dreams, huh? It seems so real. Well, it is real, sort of. Mm -hmm. You see. Part of being a Grey Warden is being able to hear the Darkspawn. That's what your dream was, hearing them. The Archdemon, it talks to the Horde, and we feel it just as they do. That's why we know this is really a blight. The Archdemon? Is that the dragon? I don't know if it's really a dragon, but it sure looks like one. But yes, that's the Archdemon. It mm -hmm. takes a bit, but eventually you can block the dreams out. Some of the older Grey Wardens say they can understand the Archdemon a bit, but I sure can't. Anyhow, when I heard you thrashing around, I thought I should tell you. It was scary at first for me, too. Um, any other surprises I should know about? Other than dying young and the whole defeat the Blight alone thing? No, I'm all tapped out for surprises. Anyhow... You're up now, right? Let's pull up camp and get a move on. Hey, 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 wait, no. A lot of quests, man. By the way, I level up. Oh, specialization. I think I will take the spirit healer. That's good. Revival, life ward. Man, a lot of good things here. Are you kidding me? Didn't feel up. 
uh, level up. Only my main. What's that here? Only my main level up? Looks like. Hey, buddy. Oh, why you little? What? Your furry friend here took offense at me getting near his food. He snapped at me. Look. Hardly any blood brown. Sometimes I forget that he's a war dog. That'll teach me. Yes, of course. I once heard a really old legend about how the hound warriors in the days of the old tribes would feed their Mabari the flesh of the vanquished. Why, why Ali, sir? Well, that's what I heard anyway. It would sometimes be human flesh. Appear here when I want to pet the dog. Oh, like you can tell the difference. For all you know, maybe you've already been fed something. Someone. Uh, don't listen to all this thing. Hey! Oh my god. Uh, who's this guy? Oh, the guy You're that... a hard man to find. Where are my manners? The name is Levy. Levy Dryden. Did Duncan ever mention me? Levy of the coins? Levy the trader? Hmm. I never heard of you. Really? He never told you of old Levy? We've known each other for years. But here I am carrying on while you have a blight to stop. Don't want to waste your time. But you see, Duncan promised that together we'd look into something important for the Wardens. Who the fuck is this and guy? And for me. But poor Duncan's. Well, no more. A tragedy it is, but that. But I know he would want his work carried on. His pledge fulfilled. What uh, promise did Duncan make to you? My family, well, past a bit checkered to see. Nobles look at us with disdain. My great great grandmother, Sophia Dryden, was the last warden commander of Ferelden back when the wardens were known as freeloaders. So King Olin banished the wardens and he took House Dryden's land and titles. Just tell me what I need to know. Duncan wanted to reclaim the old Grey Warden base, Soldier's Peak. Oh. Perhaps we'll uncover evidence to restore my family's honour along the way. Nobody's been to Soldier's Peak since the Grey Wardens were banished, but I found a way. They say it's haunted, and it's certainly dangerous. Will you help me? Man, Soldier's Peak is not a DLC content where you can have like a base. Okay, I will help you. A thousand blessings upon you, Warden. I'll mark down the location on your map. When you arrive, we'll pick our way through the tunnels together. Okay. Man, I, I just took a hundred quests. And that guy disappeared. Ah, it's good to see you, my timely rescuer. 
Spode on Fedic at your service once again. Mm -hmm. I saw your camp and remember the kind offer that you made the last time we met. And is there anywhere safer for a poor merchant and his son to sleep? I think not. I'm perfectly willing to offer you a fine discount for the inconvenience of our presence. How does that sound? Good? Yes? Okay. We are free to stay. Wonderful. Thank the gentleman, won't you, boy? Thank you, sir. We won't be a bother to you and your companions, I assure you. If you should need enchantments, simply Man. talk to my boy. Otherwise, Man. come speak with me. That boy. Hello. The boy's a bit simple, but he's rather good with enchantments. One of those tranquil fellas actually called him a... What was it now? A savant. I had no idea such a thing existed. I think the boy is under tranquil himself. <laughs> okay, what enchantment he do? He can fold lyrium into almost any weapon or piece of armor. Though naturally some of the more extravagant materials will take more lyrium than others. It's a process that some of the master smiths back in Orzammar will perform. But my boy here is just as adept at it. Isn't that right, boy? Enchantment! And there you have it. Uh, I want to see what you oh, have. Oh, certainly. I can do that for you. Just come with me. Okay. You have a fucking backpack. Man, this, this is for a, for a dog. I think. Wow. Backpack seven goals. Are you kidding me? Okay, let me sell some shit. <clears throat> This heavy chain meal one gold. Hmm. First, let me... Wait a second. Alistair. Mental resistor.
Hmm. I don't know. Morigan. Liliana. I don't have a bell for uh, Morrigan and Liliana. I can sell everything here. If there's anything I can do for you, please, please tell me. I'm sure you'll be pleased with the goods my boy and I have collected and with your discount. Please. Please, please, I will sell everything. Because I need that backpack. Give me that backpack. I increased to 90 now, but I have only 73 silver. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Enchantment? I want... An enchant enchantment! Yeah. How the enchantment working? You have no items to enchant? Are you kidding me? Hmm. Uh, maybe I need to unequip. Let me see. Enchantment? Enchantment! No. Why cannot enchant anything? Weird. Something you need? I'm sure either my boy or I can help you so out. So what's your story exactly? Well, if you're really interested, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I am originally from Orzammar, the famed dwarven city that lies beneath the stately Frostback Mountains. I was a merchant there, too. Merchant caste. These things are in the blood, you know. You can't just leave them behind. I ran a fairly successful business. Rare artifacts, you know. Old things, grand things. The nobles loved them. 
Reminded them of the lost glory days, I suppose. Why did you leave? One day, a noble woman came to my store. She looked around for a bit and then started shrieking in dismay. Apparently, she believed that a pair of braces I had for sale once belonged to her brother. He'd been lost in a cave-in, you see, while on an expedition to clear out the dark spawn from one of the tunnels running close to the city. They were made specially for him. They're unique, she shrieked. He stole them from my poor brother's corpse. She had me arrested on the spot, of course. Nobles, they're touchy like that. Just a short version. Ah, was I being too long-winded? My apologies. To make a long story short, I fled home to live on the surface. It's been a decent enough life, I suppose. Now, is there anything the boy or I can get you? Ah, uh, no. Have you heard any rumors? Thank the maker we didn't lose Tian Logan at Ostagar. He pulled his troops out just in time, so it said. Without him, we'd be lost. That's what I've heard on the road, anyhow. Take it for what it is. Of course. Good fortune to you and yours. Goodbye. Okay, man, where is the... Uh, I want to see the gifts options. What do you wish of me? Wait a second. Uh, let me Google it. Dragon Age Origin Gifts. Gifts from Alistair. Man, in inventory. White ransom, black ransom. Uh, nothing here for him. Small carved statuette. Oh, this is for him. I could get used to this, you know. Plus 10, amazing. Golden side now. Okay, that was for Alistair. For Morgan, what we have here. Maybe we have something. Tribal, tribal necklace. Hmm. A fine gift. You have my thanks. Okay. I think this will be good for her as well.
Liliana Siro. I don't think I have any for her, but I will give her this ring. Oh, how dear of you. Plus five. Thank you so much. You're welcome, my dear. I got some space on my inventory, man. I don't know who will enjoy this. Let's quick save. What do you wish of me? We are in camp, so tis as good a time as any. Hey, what's happened? Uh, Liliana. Yes. I like to well, talk. here I am. Uh, what was life like in a Chantry cloister? Quiet. It was a life suited for contemplation. In the cloister, away from the fuss and the flurry mm. of the cities, I found peace. And in that stillness, I could hear the Maker. But it was not perfect. Some of my Chantry fellows were condescending. That is the nature of religious folk, I suppose. How so? When I talked about my beliefs, that the Maker mm. reveals himself in the beauty of his world, they treated me with disdain. They want to believe that he's gone, so that when he turns his gaze on them, it means they are special, chosen. He cannot possibly have love for all, the sick and the weary, the beggars and the fools. Mm, what did you say to them? What can I say to them? What they believe is what the Chantry says, and the Chantry is infallible, yes? Maybe I am wrong. But it is the Maker's place to decide if I am worthy, not men, not the Chantry. But there is work to be done, and I have talked enough for now. Don't increase the reputation. How dare you? What do you need? Ask away. Are Emon raised you? Oh, did I say that? I meant that dogs raised me. Giant slobbering dogs from the Anderfells. A whole pack of them, in fact. That's not what I remember you telling uh, Flimmer. Well, if you're going to go and pay attention to the facts, then fine, fine. Let's see, how do I explain this? I'm a bastard, and before you make any smart comments, I mean the fatherless kind. My mother was a serving girl in Redcliffe Castle who died when I was very young. Arleman wasn't my father, but he took me in anyhow and put a roof over my head. He was good to me, and he didn't have to be. I respect the man, and I don't blame him anymore for sending me off to the Chantry once I was old enough. Why did he send you off to the Chantry? Arleman eventually married a young woman from Orlais, which caused all sorts of problems between him and the King because it was so soon after the war. But he loved her. Anyhow, then you, Arlesa, resented the rumours which pegged me as his bastard. They weren't true, but of course they existed. The Arl didn't care, but she did. So off I was packed to the nearest monastery at age 10. Just as well. The Arlesa made sure the castle wasn't a home to me by that point. She despised me. Uh, you're probably luckier than most Orphans. I suppose you're right. <laughs> I wasn't raised as the Arl's son, though, if you're picturing that. I slept in hay out in the stables, not on silk sheets. I remember I had an amulet. 
with Andraste's holy symbol on it. The only thing I had of my mother's. I was so furious at being sent away, I tore it off and threw it at the wall and it shattered. Stupid, stupid thing to do. Uh, I think uh, we can came by find the that amulet. times to see how I was, but I was stubborn. I hated it there and blamed him for everything. And eventually, he just stopped coming. And you do you think uh, the art will help us? No, are you sure he isn't your father? Yes, I'm quite sure. At any rate, I don't look anything like him. You'll see for yourself. Not that it stopped the rumors any. All I know is that the Arl is a good man and well-loved by the people. He also was King Kaelin's uncle, so he has a personal motivation to see Loghain pay for what he did. Anyway, that's really all there is to the story. Okay... There's Morrigan, there's the vendors. We can move. Indeed. Indeed. Yes. Uh, I still need to stay in the lottering. I need to go to talk with the big mother at the chantry and uh, I need to see what the hell she want for that uh, for the big guy in the cage to praise him. If I remember correctly he can be a companion. And why is that landmark to be? Why am I doing like here? What is that? Oh. Okay. Are you kidding me? I have an injury now?
HP. Man! I ignored completely crafting. Holy crap. Uh, I need to activate again. What buff I have? I have arcane shield. I have broke armor, flaming weapons, the dog. Everything is fine. Very well. It shall be done. Hmm, that's a cave? Nope. But these fucking spiders was hard to kill. Let me get yes. a Liliana buff. Right away. I cannot go up here. By the way, if I remember correctly, in this game the mobs don't respawn. Which I like that. So I take it you did not enjoy your Templar training? That's directed at me, I take it. Do you see any others about? The path of righteousness is full of hardship, but the Maker smiles upon its travelers. Three gold. Wow. When bears attack, accept. Accept. We accept everything. Uh, let's see what the lady want for the big guys in the cage. Then uh, I think I can leave the town. Greetings, Grey Warden. What okay. can I do for you? Uh, what can you tell me about the uh, imprisoned Konari? I was there at the farmhold. The beast stood there, wet with the blood of the children. He didn't even deny slaughtering them. The revered mother ordered him caged. She has more mercy than I do. But perhaps she is right, and the Maker has love for all his creations, even the Kunari. Uh, is there any, a, a way he could be released? You can ask the revered mother. I say let him rot until the Darkspawn claim him. Okay. Travel safely, and may the Maker watch over you.
Oh, I missed that bookshelf. I shall do it. Liliana. Oh, bronze symbol of unrest. That's a gift for you, Liliana. Good day, Sister Liliana. I'm surprised to see you're still in Lothering. It is good to see you as well, Your Reverence. Is there something I can do for you then? May the Maker guard you, Grey Warden. Wait, I talk with uh, Liliana now? Yes. What can I do for you now? Uh, I want to talk about Sam, the Canary imprisoned. It might have been kinder to execute him, but I leave his fate to the Maker. Why does he interest you? Uh... What did he do? He butchered an entire farmhold. Only one of the youngest hid long enough to survive. The child said his father had found the canary gravely wounded and took him in. That kindness was repaid with murder. The bandsman found the canary just standing amidst the carnage. He did not resist them. I, I, I don't think that. I think it's something else here. Are you sure he did it? He confessed quite readily, but would give no reason for the crime. Even the Caesar knights who apprehended him were disturbed by the carnage. However docile he appears, do not be fooled. That canary is a danger. Hmm. What if this... ...cause an incident with his people? The Maker demands justice, regardless of his race. Is there any way I can convince him to release him? Then his next victims might count you and me as their murderers. I was thinking you might release him into my custody. And what do you say on this, Leliana? You know your friend better than I. These are unusual times, Your Reverence. With us, the Kunari might do some good. I am sure of it, in fact. Were things not so desperate? Very well, I trust you. Take these keys to his cage and make her watch over you. Thank you, Your Reverence. Your trust is not misplaced. That was simple. Was so easy. Was so easy, man. Uh, can I take this guy chest? Hmm? <laughs> don't suppose you're looking to buy something. All right, just don't buy everything up. I don't need that. Okay, I think it's one more quest or two here. Then I think I can leave this place. Uh, 
Uh, there's no more chests here. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Where the hell I shall go now? The return path. Oh, no reason to travel in that direction anymore. So, yeah, I was right. I cannot go back to the starting area to... Man. We can travel directly from this screen. I don't know exactly where to go, bro. Find the orphan mother and call the infected beard. North of Lothering, okay. Lesser held. Oh, I had three. Okay, let's go to free stand. Let's go to give the healing potion to that guy in uh, the tavern. They say your mother is Flemeth. A witch of the Kokari Wards. They also say that I've got a cousin. The innkeeper want the Elder Miriam. Wait, 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 wait. Make us blessings upon you, Warden. Who is Elder Miriam? Oh, is the lady outside? I think. Close to the tavern here. Why is this loading screen, bro? Take too long. Wager all these elves are uh, oh yeah, that lady, Miriam. Have any luck finding herbs in the woods? Yes, I did. This will help many people. You're a good sort, you know. Yes, I am. With the silver, thank you. Okay, now we can save this guy. You wish something more of me? <clears throat> I have the key to open your cage. I confess, 
I did not think the priestess would part with it. She agreed to release you into my custody. So be it. Set me free and I will follow you against the Blight. How can you help us exactly? I have spent my life in the Vanguard. I know war. And your lands need all the help they can get. Very well. And so it is done. I will follow you into battle. In doing so, I shall find my atonement. Thank you, Stan. Glad to have you with us. May we proceed? I am eager to be elsewhere. Uh... He's a two-handed... guy. Blood and damnation! Oh, Alisa, level up, my boy. Man, I want, I want the Zerka. I want this Tratton. The warrior adopt challenging posture that increase enemy hostility with each melee attack. That's good. Basically, the chanter board find the orphan mother. This will be outside, north of the town. Create a poison for Berlin. Uh, okay. Redcliffe. Peter Gridge. Deliver the letter of conscript to all three conscripts. Peter Gridge in Lothering. Who the fuck is Peter Gridge? In Lothering. Mm -hmm. Uh, maybe it's around town, it's not in town. I don't think it's in town, that guy. Okay, let's leave the village. But I cannot... Travel.
You cannot travel at this time. Why? I need all the time to walk. What the fuck? I shall do it. Okay, that was the yeah. I found the body of Sarha, the orphan boy's mother. Get a reward for from the chantry. So tell me something, Morrigan. Did you live there in that forest your entire life? I left it on occasion, but I always returned. Let him take note. Fifty silver quest completed. Thank you. I have no idea who is that. Peter. I don't think he's here. Maybe when I leave the village will be around village, not in village. Maybe. I don't know. I, ha I have no idea where to go exactly now. Maybe to... Redcliffe Village. <clears throat> I don't know if it's the right place to go after uh, Orion. Look, can we talk for a moment? I need to tell you something. I am. Um should probably have told you earlier. Uh, what's in your mind? I told you before how Al Eamon raised me, right? That my mother was a serving girl at the castle and he took me in? The reason he did that was because... Well, because my father was King Marek. Uh, 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 which uh, made uh. Kaelin my... half-brother, I suppose. So you can be a king? Doesn't that make you the heir to the throne? Maker's breath, I hope not. <laughs> I don't think so. You don't think so, do you? I'm a bastard. 
And, and nobody even knows about me. I, I would have told you, but it never really meant anything to me. I was inconvenient, a possible threat to Kaylin's rule, and so they kept me secret. I'd never talked about it to anyone. Everyone who knew either resented me for it or they coddled me. Even Duncan kept me out of the fighting because of it. I didn't want you to know as long as possible. I'm sorry. I think I understand. Oh, good. I'm glad. It's not like I got special treatment for it anyhow. At any rate, that's it. That's what I had to tell you. I thought you should know about it. Uh, uh, Besides my unholy love of fine cheeses and a minor obsession with my hair, no, that's it. Just the prince thing. Okay. You're the heir to the throne then? Let's hope not. I'm the son of a commoner and a Grey Warden to boot. It was made very clear to me early on that there was no room for me raising any rebellions or such nonsense. And that's fine by me. No, if there's an heir to be found, it's Al Eamon himself. He's not of royal blood, but he is Kaelin's uncle, and more importantly, very popular with the people. Though, if he's really as sick as we've heard... Oh, no, I, I, I don't want to think about that. I really don't. So there you have it. Now can we move on? And I'll just pretend you still think I'm some nobody who was too lucky to die with the rest of the Grey Wardens. As you command, my prince. Oh, lovely. I'm going to regret this. Somehow I just know it. <laughs> Plus two, he approved. That's good. Okay, guys. Go. Salut, salut, colonel. It's an element of the security, man. RPG Dragon Age The 